Blueprint of an Electric Guitar by Ron Heller. What exactly is an electric guitar? An electric guitar is comprised of many different components. It produces its sound through string vibration, which is then converted into an electric signal that is sent to an amplifier. The guitar neck extends from the guitar headstock to the guitar body. It also contains the fretboard and the truss rod. The truss rod is a long metal rod located inside the neck of the guitar, which is designed to add reverse tension to the neck to counteract string tension and keep the neck straight. The headstock is the part at the top of the guitar that holds the tuning pegs, posts, keys, and string trees. Tuners are geared pegs which guitar strings are fed through. These are then turned to tune the guitar. The frets are the area between two metal fret wires. The fret markers are used to mark fret location. They are usually placed on frets 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 12, 15, 17, and 19. The fretboard or fingerboard is the area of wood on the guitar neck where the metal frets are placed. Guitar pickups are magnets which are wrapped in copper coils and then mounted on a bobbin, then covered by plastic or metal. Electric guitars have six metal strings of differing gauges which are usually comprised of nickel or copper. Standard tuning for these are E, A, D, G, B, E. The bridge of the guitar is set near the base of the guitar body and is where the guitar strings start. The bridge also transfers string vibrations to the body. The output jack is a quarter inch mono output on the guitar into which a guitar cable is inserted. Volume and tone knob controls are designed to individually control both volume and the tone of the guitar by increasing and or decreasing signal. The guitar body is the main bulk of the instrument. It can affect tone and houses the guitar electronics, output jack, tone and volume controls, pickup, bridge, and tailpiece. There are many different brands, models, and types of electric guitars available today, and Gibson and Fender, two of the original manufacturers, still produce them on a mass scale, and their respective brands are wildly popular, each with their own individual models. There are many different brands, models, shapes, and sizes of electric guitars available today. All unique in aesthetic, yet similar in design, and all being comprised of the same basic components. As you can see, an electric guitar is more than just strings and wood, and they are all not alike. Although used to create the art that is music, some can be a form of art all in themselves.